Hello dudes and dudettes. Today we are going to explain to you what is the PlayStation Vita. It is this PlayStation over here. This is the PlayStation Vita. It's a this is the Sony portable of course. And don't mind this unscripted again. Oh my god, will be weird. So for starters, we're going to try power it on. PlayStation Vita. Right here, this will power the Vita on. There. It's on now. The PlayStation Vita is being powered on. It gives you a message of warning, of course. And there we go. The console has started. Yes. Of course, you can choose themes. If you choose themes, you can always just, I hate when it doesn't respond, there, you got the Metal Gear collection in it if you want, you got all the apps right here, Sony did a good job on this PlayStation Vita, anyway, we can go down, we got this great list of games, all those you can buy it on the PlayStation Vita. Beautiful, right? Not only that, you can download PlayStation PSP games on it, and you can download PlayStation One games and minis. You get live tweet, yes, live tweet. And here, when you play Vita, you can have a Twitter with you. So when someone DM you or do anything, you can use live tweet for it. There used to be YouTube too. Of course, you still can mod it to play some things. Yeah. Anyway, we'll go back. Yes, you can play some PlayStation 3 games. Not all. You can play remote play here. PS4 link. PS3 doesn't work well, you just can play some games, very little, and PlayStation games, yes, you can play for some reason. Anyway, so, as you can see, this is the Model 1000, which is OLED. I advise you to buy the OLED version, unless you like more Patreon life, you go with the 2000 version. Here we go. By the way, I have both. But I prefer the OLED, and I game with it too much. No burden. Okay. So yeah, I know now you're wondering. The game. Okay, go try a game. What we got on is Metal Gear Solid HD Collection. It got four Metal Gear games in it. Yes, four. There you go. Exciting, <laughs> right? We got Metal Gear 3. There is two MXX Metal Gear games in it. One and two. And you got Metal Gear 2. So four in total. And you also can play Peace Walker if you download it separately. Okay. I'm just gonna show you the gameplay. It actually looks beautiful on the PlayStation Vita. There you go. This is Metal Gear Solid 3 running on an OLED screen on portable. And it's semi HD. Not really, but it's so clear you can call it HD. Over here, even it can look better than your TV. Unless you have an OLED TV, then you can have that colors that you see right here. And you can see it's working great. Nothing really prevents the game from working. You can have it 3D since this is the Substance version. Yeah, I forget how to put it here, but yeah. So that's it. You get more 
my hairy ass you know, body to kind of be supposed to be here. Those stuff. I really think they could have used this in a better way. Many people didn't use it. I like this idea of near where you can contact near people around you. Sorry, my bad. Get press. This button over here. And you got this one. It works. Anyway, yeah. We got here parental controls. If you are parents in having a kid, you can use that to prevent him playing things you don't want him to play. Play something good. Anyway. And then you got the email, videos, and calendar, and party messages. Those were things that were really great, but nobody used it. I even tried near. Nobody wanted to play with me. So that's it. Thanks, dudes and dudettes, for here, hearing me, teaching you PlayStation Vita. Again, remember... That these videos is unscripted. Sorry about my head. I need to fix my head. So.